guys, Cindy Otter here with My Artsy Endeavors. Guess what time it is? It is time for a book review. Ta -ta -da. All right, this is for my year, 2017. Um, we're going to move that aside. And this is the book that we're going to review today. This is called Art Journal, Art Journey. Collage and Storytelling for Honoring Your Creative Process by Nicole Ray. And Nicole is N-I-C-H-O-L-E. Ray is R-A-E. <clears throat> this book normally runs $24.99. And this is this is a different style of journaling. Now, I don't know if I've talked to you guys about this or not yet, but I've my personal journaling is is morphing. It's going from a lot of writing into more of an art journal slash storytelling slash put a few words on the page okay um, previously my my personal um, journaling was all basically just writing in a few stickers but it's been morphing and this right here is what really got to me when I looked at this book it's simple it's to the point yet it means something right so what has she got in here? She's got the journaling process, preparing for the creative process, a creative adventure mini projects, the creative collage process, and inspiration gal gallery. She gives us a list of everything you need, which are very simple supplies. Um, there's not a whole lot on here that we probably already don't have in our rooms. Um, yeah, these are all basic supplies. Um, and what she does is she talks about your creative journey. And this is what she says. When beginning on a journey, there are moments of excitement, and then there are the moments when you start to write your to-do list, filling it with what you need to do before you go, what you need to pack, all the things you want to do on your trip. So she's talking about a trip on this one. Uh, the beauty of a creative journey is that the preparation and the adventure are all part of the journey. Throughout art journaling, your to-do list becomes documentation of your path, and what you need to do becomes the story you are creating. What you want to do on your trip unfolds into your ideas and visions. Along this adventure, we will explore together how you can doc document your journey using art journaling. Now, I'm not going to go into the, the um, rest of this, but that's the beginning of her introduction. And what she does is she actually takes everyday items, book pages, um, a, a computer or typewriter, okay, she writes out words, tags, um, paper clips, buttons, photos maybe of her, and she, she builds them into an art journal, art journal pages. And it's a very, I want to say it's a minimalistic way of doing art journaling because I'm not seeing a whole ton of paint and stencils and all of that on here it's like a simple it's a very simple type of journaling so what this book does is it she shows you how to get organized she shows you what supplies you need um, and then she gets you into projects she will make these little projects that she shows you how to do inspirational card deck um, little mini books an altered book vintage book pages what you can do with them um, variation of hiding straight edges different ways you can hide your edges postcards words rubber stamps little bits okay so all of this shows you how to do your journey how to do your art journal journey in her process I find it intriguing I see some things that I like um, <clears throat> other things in here that I don't, something that I would not do, um, you know, a couple odd and end pages here. I'm like, yeah, that's not me. So, this one, I think it's great that she did this, but to me, that's a little bit too minimalistic. I want more on that page. I want maybe more writing or personalization, I, I would say, in my writing or in doodles on that page. But that's just me. So if you're looking to change the way that you personal journal and if you want to bring art journaling into it in a very simple, minimalistic way, this book is fantastic because it's going to show you how to do it. All right. So again, it's called Art Journal, Art Journey, and it's by Nicole Ray. 
last name R-A-E, first name N-I-C-H-O-L-E. And I think it's a really a great book, I do. Um, it's one that I'm going to keep in my library, and I will go back to it time and time again and just look at simple ideas. All right? As always, like, comment, share, and subscribe. I hope you guys enjoyed this book review. I'm not going to do a project out of it. It's just the time of year where I don't have time to do that. But you guys have a wonderful day. Um, enjoy your holidays. As always, have fun. That's what life's all about. Happy creating, and I'll talk to you soon. See you next year. Bye.